Okay, g'day. Um, I'm going to just quickly explain how to do a 3D eyeball with Smart Actions. It's not a very complicated setup. I won't do the full rig and just the basic how to. Um, you can work it out from there how to do something more complicated and fit it into the rest of the rig. Okay, so here we have one eye and um, just so you see it working, there you go. It's works like this and essentially what it is is an actual uh, 3D eye. There's first of all a regular vector layer over that. Um, I'll just put a quick link on it there so you can see it looking like an eye. Um, if I take it off then we have um, an actual oh, there's a background white there uh, and an actual eyeball uh, made in Moho in 3D. So um, I'll explain how to quickly do that and it rotates with the smartphones obviously. So if I turn all this back on you'll see um, uh, horizontal axis vertical axis and you can Rig that up to a single uh, target bone if you want. Let's turn this off and go back to zero and make a vector layer. And I'm going to use just the uh, point here and notice where the center is. Okay, so this will be where the vector gets lathed from. I'll uh, show you what I mean. So this way, pupil up for the iris and then down for the eyeball. Um, that might seem a bit weird now but if I now I'll go and make it into a stroke right um, and I should really make three different shapes of different colors. Create shape um, that should be Create shape, and it'll be white, um, and this one will be for. This time we'll make it um, make it brown. Let's make it a brown eye. A little orange. Okay, so then we simply go to the vector, three D options, conversion, lathe, apply, bingo. It, when you lay that you can only have one shape so what you do now is uh, go to the reset view then you press alt to control single select one single point select alt and the curvature and then just there we go and there you've got an eyeball so now copy this three times One will be the white and the pupil and the iris. Okay, so then you delete a white, delete these two, and a pupil, delete these two, and the iris, delete these two. All right. Okay, that's white. That's good. That's, and there we have it. Okay. So in the vector layer settings, actually, I forgot about this. Let's get rid of all these things. Apply. Hi. Hi. And there we go. I don't need any of that stuff. And that's your basic eyeball. Now it's best to get the shape before cutting it up. As you see, I've made that too deep. So anyway, you get the thing. And uh, also, 
forgot about this. Let's take the um, shading off that eye. And you can keep the shading on the iris if you wanted. That's up to you. Smart actions are covered elsewhere. So you know what that is. It's a horizontal, two horizontals in each direction. Vertical, etc. And then when you get to the main line, it works as expected. Okay, so thanks for watching. See you next time.